Hello, this is uh, Richard from the DIY Mechanic. Today we are showing about how to upgrade this uh, OBD2 code scanner and print the data via the USB port from this scanner. So the first step you need to, when you need to do upgrade, you just need to hold any button and connect this USB port to the scanner. So once you plug in, it will enter the program mode, upgrade mode. You will see the version is 1.8 and there's a website for you to download the remote to download the remote upgrade tool. Let's check out the website from this from the browser. This is the website ITO scanner and you have a page for you to download this software. So once you go to the uh, download page and you will see there's a download button so you can click on that and it will it will allow you to download the upgrade tool. So after you download it, you will see there's a inside the package there's a one called uplink. You can install it, double click. And please make sure your antivirus software is closed, otherwise there might be some uh, conflict in the driver. So uh, just follow the step. So I will prompt you to install the device driver. And after that, it will be finished. At this time, you can check your device manager. And from the device manager, go to the port. You will see this uh, device is detected properly. So if you have problem, you need to uh, reinstall the drivers or update the driver by yourself. So after you install it, you will have a program. It's named Uplink, double kick. So this is the program for the uh, Conway upgrade, Conway OBD2 Diagnostic 2. You have three options. One option is internet upgrade. And at this page, it would it will prompt whether there's the internet connected and also if your device is connected it will show in here like the device is connected to the COM port 17 and all you need if you need upgrade just check the upgrade if there is it will, it will ask you to uh, whether you want to upgrade or not if not just leave it and here, this is button for the printing the data via the USB we will print out all the data storage from the USB so when you need to uh, when you need to print data from the USB you might need to enter the normal mode which is no button need to press just normal plug in and the program will be started so this is the screen that you go for diagnostic normally and inside here you can just review it you can review all this data you can review the DTC it's recorded by the wind code of vehicle and also you can view the review the data stream the live data stream it's quite useful and when you need to print with the USB connected scroll this uh, button to the print data option and you can select you can print all the data you can or you can print the selected so this is the screen it's empty and once you press any button press the ok button to to print the freeze frame there's a beeping and it will be showing this data to the pc i want to print the dtc so after a beep you will hear from here all this data has been print have been uploaded to the pc and you can modify it you can copy it, you can edit it, and the, or you can just print it and select the printer that you are connected with your PC. So after you print it out, it will normally show in like this way. And you can also print the live data. So uh, after this is. So you can print a live data stream. 
So you can see here all the data stream storage inside the scanner will be uploaded. If you have more questions, just feel free to contact us.